test your rotary laser level? Let's find out. Like the line level video, we need to look at two different planes, the front plane and the side plane. With a rotary laser, any side could be the front or the side plane. To make it simple, we'll call the side with the controls the front, making the opposite side the back, then there's the right side and left side. If you tilt in the front plane, you can see the line in front of the laser goes up and in the back goes down. If the back goes up, then the front goes down. They're always opposite each other. The lines are also still independently level, just not to each other. Also notice that when we tilt in the front plane, the side angles go out of level. If we rotate 90 degrees so the side plane projects onto the wall, we have the opposite phenomenon. The side lines go up and down and the front plane goes out of level. This makes checking your laser level really easy because when we turn the laser 180 degrees, it doubles the error. Let's take a look at that. The black middle line represents level and the green lines are the side laser lines because the front is facing parallel to the board. You can see the side line is angled down on the front side of the laser and up on the back side. When we rotate the laser, the line is still down in the front and up in the back, creating an X. Let's say this angle represents one degree from level. When we rotate the laser, it goes one degree in the opposite direction, showing a total of two degrees, doubling the actual error. Now it's time to check your level. Start by placing the level 50 feet from the wall or as far as possible. Make sure the tripod is level. This is very important so it doesn't affect the test. Point the front of the laser at the wall and mark the center of the line. It's important to mark the center of the line because the top and bottom of the line can get distorted. If you can't see the line, then use your detector. Now rotate the laser 180 degrees so the back is facing the wall. Check that it lines up with the mark. Any error will be doubled. Check the marks and make sure you're within the manufacturer's specs. Next, rotate the laser so the right side is facing the wall. The laser should line up with your mark. Now rotate the laser 180 degrees so the left side is facing the wall. If it lines up, your laser is level. If it doesn't line up, make a mark on both lines and measure the distance between the lines. This will be double the error and check it against the manufacturer's specs. You might be wondering, why do we do the test twice? If you only test one plane with one center mark, you can miss the other plane being out of level. Let's look at an example. Here I'm testing the front plane to see if the front and back lines are level to each other, and they are. Now look what happens when the side plane goes out of level and we do the same front test. The level appears level when it really isn't. That's because the center of rotation does not move. If your rotary laser can also project plumb lines, here's how to test it. Place the laser on the floor parallel to a doorway and one foot from the opening. Mark two spots on the laser line, roughly 16 inches apart. Then mark the line on the header of the doorway. Rotate the laser clockwise 180 degrees and move to the furthest mark. Line the laser up with both marks on the floor. Then check that the laser lines up with the mark on the door header. You've now accurately set up your rotary laser. If you haven't seen how to test your laser line level video, I recommend you view that too. Thank you for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next time.